the directed by John Woo label is today recognized internationally as the hallmark for high octane stylish action films. Legendary Hong Kong action director John Woo. He is the godfather of the modern action movie. Top 10 best John Woo directed movies are Wind Talkers, 2002, is the number 10. Marine Joe Enders, Nicolas Cage, is assigned to protect Ben Yazi, Adam Beach, a Navajo code talker, the Marine's new secret weapon. Ender's orders are to protect his code talker, but if Yazi should fall into enemy hands, he's to protect the code at all costs. Against the backdrop of the horrific Battle of Saipan, when capture is imminent, Ender's is forced to make a decision, if he can't protect his fellow Marine, can he bring himself to kill him to protect the code? It's my responsibility! I can't let him take it. This is over, you should come out to Navajo country. You can meet my son, and you can meet the guy who watched over daddy. Hard Target, 1993, is the number 9. Chance Boudreau, Jean-Claude Van Damme, a sailor skilled in martial arts, is employed to guard Natasha Binder, Yancey Butler, as she tracks down her father, an itinerant Vietnam veteran living in New Orleans named Douglas, Chuck Farrer. They soon uncover a sinister group of wealthy men who hunt the homeless for sport, paying them $10,000 if they can survive a cross-town journey. When Chance discovers that Natasha's father was one of their victims, he decides to destroy the evil hunters. Broken Arrow, 1996, is the number 8. Air Force pilots Vic Deacons, John Travolta, and Riley Hale, Christian Slater, are sent on an overnight top-secret mission with two nuclear weapons aboard their aircraft. But, after they are in the air, Deacons changes the plan. He attempts to kill Hale and then steals the weapons with the intent of selling them to terrorists. However, Hale survives the crash and meets up with park ranger Terry Carmichael, Samantha Mathis. Together, Hale and Terry attempt to thwart Deacon's plan. They are America's first line of defense. Best of friends. Hi, the captain. Snap of the earth. Here we go. Fierce competitors. Very nicely done. Almost as good as me. Ready to protect our nation against any threat. Carrying the nukes. You love having the power of God at your fingertips. Not tonight, buddy. But what if the enemy is one of them? Mission Impossible 2, 2000, is the number seven. Tom Cruise returns to his role as Ethan Hunt in the second installment of Mission, Impossible. This time Ethan Hunt leads his IMF team on a mission to capture a deadly German virus before it is released by terrorists. His mission is made impossible due to the fact that he is not the only person after samples of the disease. He must also contest with a gang of international terrorists headed by a turned bad former IMF agent who has already managed to steal the cure. This is not mission difficult, Mr. Hunt, it's mission impossible. Difficult to be a walk in the park for you. He 
دیگر بکره A better tomorrow, 1986, is the number six. A reforming ex-gangster tries to reconcile with his estranged policeman brother, but the ties to his former gang are difficult to break. This story is the tale of two brothers, one a successful counterfeiter and the younger a fledgling graduate of the HK Police Academy. A Better Tomorrow 2, 1987, is the number 5. A policeman, Leslie Chung, and a reformed gangster, T.I. Lung, meet their dead friend's twin, employed by a New York mob boss. The original Men in Black shook the world of action cinema in the original A Better Tomorrow. Proudly presents the explosive bullet-ridden sequel, A Better Tomorrow 2. Hard Boiled, 1992, is the number 4. Tequila is a hard-boiled cop who loses his partner in a shootout with gun smugglers. In order to bring them down, Tequila must team up with an undercover cop named Tony, who goes undercover as a hired gun with a Hong Kong triad which is run by a vicious boss named Johnny Wong. Face Off, 1997, is the number 3. Obsessed with bringing terrorist caster Troy, Nicolas Cage, to justice, FBI agent Sean Archer, John Travolta, tracks down Troy, who has boarded a plane in Los Angeles. After the plane crashes and Troy is severely injured, possibly dead, Archer undergoes surgery to remove his face and replace it with Troy's. As Archer tries to use his disguise to elicit information about a bomb from Troy's brother, Troy awakes from a coma and forces the doctor who performed the surgery to give him Archer's face. The Killer, 1989, is the number two. Chow Yun-Fat plays the titular killer, an assassin who begins to regret his life of violence after accidentally blinding singer Sally Ye during an assassination. Danny Lee plays the cop on his case, who begins to find he can relate to the killer more than he can to many of his colleagues. <laughs> Killer is great cinema. The Killer, a thriller comedy that will leave you breathless. Red Cliff, 2008, is the number one. In ancient China, the emperor of the Han dynasty allows General Cao Cao, Fen Zhang, to declare war against the rebellious southern provinces, with the intention of unifying the entire country. CAO's large army quickly advances, killing civilians and soldiers alike. To resist CAO, the southern warlords form an alliance led by Viceroy Zhou Yu, 
Tony Liu. Outnumbered, Zhou relies upon elaborate formations and unorthodox strategies to fight against CAO's overwhelming forces. Legendary director John Wu. Comes a new epic like no other. A John Wu film. All information has been compiled from different online portals, including Wikipedia.